So, in this novel, the majority of the story takes place in the Sahara, particularly the western part of Sahara in the countries of Mali, Niger, Algeria and Morocco. And I've been wanting to set a story in the Sahara for a long time. I was originally, originally wrote a story with Andrew Warren in his Thomas Kane series called Sandfire and I originally planned to set that in the Sahara but we ended up deciding to write that story and set it in the Arabian Peninsula which is also a large sand desert. But the Sahara, it's much bigger. It's the world's largest hot desert, it covers an area of 9.2 million square kilometres, so that's how big it is. If you want a comparison of uh, that size, it's about the same size as the uh, Australian country or US if you take away Alaska, so rather big. And it gets so hot, the temperatures can reach about 45 degrees Celsius during the day and double that on the sand, so you know, baking conditions. I'm not sure what that is in the old temperature, I think it's something like about 100 degrees, 100 plus degrees Fahrenheit. I just was always been fascinated by the Sahara. I've, I've been to deserts like that in Australia and South America, but not the Sahara myself, but I thought, you know, I want to draw on my experience of backpacking around Africa and this was a great location. So the Sahara plays a big part in the Trigger Man. 